Christy Hamburg, your Norwex Independent Sales Consultant, and today I want to share with you some of the additional cleaners that we offer in case you need a little bit of extra oomph to your microfiber products. All right, the first product I'm gonna share with you is one of my personal favorites. It's the cleaning paste. And the first thing you're probably going to notice when you open it up is if you're expecting like a lotion consistency, it's not. It's actually hard as a rock and it's supposed to be that way. It's not defective, so don't worry. Um, and then the second thing you're probably gonna notice is the smell. If you are one of those people that after cleaning with just microfiber and water, you actually miss that clean smell, this is a great alternative for you. It has a really light, refreshing citrus scent to it. So I love cleaning paste. So what you're gonna do is I wrote, to show you that it really does work, I wrote Norwex on a tile, real tile. I wrote my name on a piece of laminate flooring with a Sharpie, because if your kids are anything like mine, you will have Sharpie somewhere in your house at some point in time. So how to use it is you're gonna grab your wet Enviroplath. You are going to just swipe it over your cleaning paste, get some on there, and then you're gonna go to town scrubbing, all right? So do you see it? Look how it already took some off. Just keep cleaning. And I promise I actually let that Sharpie sit on there for a while because I wanted to make sure it was dry and really on there. All right, now let's try my name. This one you might need to do a little bit of scrubbing to get off because of the texture to the laminate, but it will still come all the way off. You see that? So that just proves that our cleaning paste is magic in a jar is what I like to refer it to. Um, the other thing that I love cleaning paste for is cleaning my glass stove cooktop and you can also use it if you have a gas stove. So for that, I actually recommend Spiri sponges. You can use an EnviroCloth. I just love these because they have a little bit extra scrubbing power to them. You're going to get it wet just like the EnviroCloth. You're going to swipe it over your cleaning paste and you're going to go to town and you will not believe what this cleaning paste will be able to take off your stove. It's also great for bathtub rings. Just just pretty much anywhere that you need some extra elbow grease in a jar. Um, it does not recommend its use on brushed stainless steel or on real wood or um, like on natural stone, like quartz and granite and things like that. Um, as always, anytime you use this product, you're gonna want to test it in an inconspicuous spot first, just to make sure that it doesn't scratch your surface. And then once you're good to go, you can go ahead and clean the whole thing. Another great cleaner is our Blue Diamond. This is an all-purpose bathroom cleaner. I like to mix just one part Blue Diamond into seven parts water, just in a spray bottle. And it's great if you just need a little bit of extra cleaner in your bathroom. Um, you can spray it on your bathroom counters, sinks, tubs, showers, wherever you just feel like you need a little extra scrubbing power. Um, you can also just do one or two drops directly onto a bathroom scrub mitt. Again, this is just a little bit of extra scrubbing power. I love this combination for my showers and tubs. Um, and I also use it to clean my toilet. So I just put a drop, and don't worry, this is a brand new toilet bowl brush. It has not been used. I would not put that on my kitchen counters. Are you kidding me? Um, but you would just put a drop or two of Blue Diamond directly onto our ergonomic toilet bowl brush. And I love it. Do you see the shape? This gets under the rim of your toilet really well. And it also is embedded with silver, so it will not get disgusting like your traditional toilet bowl brushes. But anyway, um, I just use this in place of my traditional toilet bowl cleaner with my ergonomic toilet bowl brush. Um, just to show you how well it works on rust, I'm just gonna pour a little bit into my cap. And here is a penny. I tried to find the dirtiest one that I could. All right, so I'm literally going to dip it in there. I don't think I poured enough in, but you can see it's working. I'm, I'm gonna pour a little bit more in there. All 
just so I can get a little bit higher on my penny. But see what it's already doing where it did touch? All right, so I'm gonna dip it. Do you see? Isn't that amazing? It can do this to a penny. Imagine what it can do in your bathroom. So I'm just gonna take a wet Enviro cloth and wipe it off. But you can see the difference from where the blue diamond touched and where it didn't. All right, so it's amazing. I love it in my bathroom. This is the blue diamond. And finally, we're gonna talk about descaler. If you have really hard water and it leaves more of like a chalky film on your bathroom fixtures, the descaler is probably your better bet. Blue Diamond is more, like I said, an all-purpose cleaner and it does great for rust if you have hard water leaving rust marks. Okay, so I per personally don't have a lot of chalky substances on my brand new home fixtures. I'm lucky in that aspect and OroX has done a great job of keeping up with my bathroom. So I'm actually gonna show you some before and after pictures. So as you can see, hopefully it does a great job cleaning kitchen sinks, tubs and showers. Look at that. See that's the chalky substance I'm talking about. And there's the after. So it does, we do have this in our bathroom. I could demo that if anyone wants to see. And again, just that chalky, um, Substance left from hard water, does great cleaning shower faucets. So that is the descaler. Um, I would, if you're between these two, I normally tell people to start with the blue diamond just because there is a whole lot of uses for it. Um, and if you feel like this isn't high power enough, you need a little bit of extra umph, then I would try the descaler. So those are just some of our additional cleaning products that I use and love and wanted to share with you. Again, I just want to remind you that before you use any of those cleaning products, please, please, please test in an inconspicuous spot first to make sure that it's not going to damage your surface. Um, I do not want to be held liable for anything that goes wrong. So definitely test your surfaces first. Most of our additional cleaning products are not recommended on natural stone. And like I said, the cleaning paste, no wood or or um, brush stainless steel. So again, if you have any questions, please let me know. You are more than welcome to order from my website at www.christyhamburg.norwax.biz. Or if you're shop shopping with a party, please use the party link provided. Thank you.